place, eh? Yeah, that was pretty damn good. Let's do it again. stayed with them for a, a period of time after Cyrus got back from, from the war. And uh, Cyrus, as I said, was, was doing a lot of party and he said he was out every night you know, just getting wasted and, and he'd come home and the house would be really dark and sometimes uh, he would have sex with his wife when he came home. And sometimes he would have sex with her wife's brother sometimes. Um, and he said that his exact words to, to me about that was uh, you know, I must have fucked that son of a bitch in the ass a dozen times without even knowing it. Without even knowing it. He said he had the same kind of ass as his wife had, which was this like perfectly heart-shaped thing that he just found glorious. And, and at this point in the conversation, he turned to me and he said, you know, you know, you and I could, could, could do something like that. And, um, you know, and I said, well, you know, I, I personally am, you know, I'm straight. I'm you know, getting a loving on with, with you. And, and uh, he said, well, he said, no, listen to me. He said, um, like, let's just say that we were to give each other blowjobs. And uh, you wouldn't necessarily know that it was me giving you a blowjob if you closed your eyes. Because it's just the feeling. It's not... It's not the, the point is not whether there's a, a male or a female or straight or gay. It's just a feeling. So, and I said, well, yeah, but I would know because, you know, we're talking about it right now. And I, I, would, I would know. And uh, he said, no, no, you just, 
you just got to get your mind right. But, oh, uh, I forgot to mention at this point, too, by this point, he had already sort of uh, unzipped himself and uh, produced his, uh, his George and was, you know, was kind of getting ready. And I, I, I just, uh, the uh, sort of shock and sadness of it hit me at that point. And I, I grabbed a, a one more beer out of his warm 12-pack of Milwaukee's Best, and I, I went home. I think I learned many lessons that day, and uh, uh, I guess maybe there's like a couple of things that have stuck with me more, more mostly about it. And one would be uh, don't necessarily come home drinking with loving on your mind. And, uh, and secondly, uh, you know, the the main thing in life is to get your mind right, because then you can you can do anything. <laughs> 